Have you ever tried to send a file to Checkpoint Gateway or Checkpoint Management Server and you try to log in with SSP and then you get this message that you have the incorrect shell. Either you can just change the bash on your existing user or you can create an additional user that is for SCP only. I would recommend you to create a dedicated user for this because it's really valuable to have it and you shouldn't use the default. So if you want to see how to do a dedicated user, please click on the video above. But uh, let's try to just change the, the shell for this one. So if we log into the, the gateway or to the management station in this case, and we need to go to expert mode. And if we want to see which existing shell are we using, then we do egrep, and then we do the username, and then we do etc, and then password. And here you can see that you are in CLI, so this is Clish. So if we want to change this to bash, then we do chsh, important that you have small letters, if you do capital, it will not work. Minus s, then bin, bash. And then you type the username that you want to change on. And here you see that the shell has changed for the user admin. So if we do like this now, and we try it again, 192.168.1.1.10, admin and our password. Now we should get in directly, and we get into the folder. If we want to change this back, well, then we do the same, sh, ch, sh, minus s, and then we need to take this one. So this is our existing one. And then admin. So now the shell has changed again. And notice here, we are not kicked out right away. So this is an existing session, so it will only work for a new session. So I think this is it for this video. I hope you did like this short one. And uh, thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Take care.